Hey guys, it's the Lazy Summer here. I'm gonna make this intro quick because my throat is killing me right now, but I'm just trying to get these videos edited. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's not much to it. We're just basically seeing how Taryn's life is now that her grandma has passed away. And we're just trying to figure out, like, you know, what her next steps are. So I hope you guys enjoy this episode. Give this video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. We upload every Wednesday and Sunday for this LP. And we will have some LPs every Friday starting soon. I don't know when, but starting soon. So let's get into the video. Bye. All right, y'all. So we have Mr. Oliver has moved in he is a freelancer programmer he already had this he wants to be a computer whiz practice programming for five total hours so we have to do that but i love it that he already had that because now he does free he's a freelance programmer so he can literally stay home with miss peyton and still like get money um, because I was like, oh, well, maybe I want him to be in school, too, to hang out with his best friend. But then I was like, no, you know, they can still hang out. He, We're just going to say he went to a trade school for his programming. <laughs> and he can help around the house and stuff. But, yes, I wanted to let you guys know on that. This is um, Mr. Oliver's girlfriend, Miss Sloan. I don't. I know you guys know of her being um, Taryn's friend, but I did mention that they were together. They're, they're actually not even girlfriend and boyfriend, but um, they be doing the do and they like each other. So. Um, I was gonna celebrate tonight because Miss Taryn has finished her first week, well, her first semester of school, her first year of school, because technically each, um, what is it, each week is a whole year, which is crazy, but, um, yeah, I had emailed... Miss Taryn's team. Well, I don't know why she's looking like this. But I had emailed her teachers and they said that she was failing. I was like, bro, she's been to every single class. She's. Why do you just have a case right here? Like, you don't even have a phone. You just have a case. But anyway, she's been to every class. She's done all her homework. She's been on time, not late at all. Like,. I don't understand, but I realized that I wasn't having her study, so I was like, damn, maybe that's why, but she did, she submitted the term paper, she didn't study a lot for two of the classes, so I won't be surprised, I won't be surprised if that is um, a fail, but I really hope it's not, like, that. this is why I hate doing um, Discovery University, because it's literally... It's so tedious. It's so tedious. You're not able to do anything else other than this work. And then the um, homework takes so long. Homework takes long. The projects take long. I think if they just didn't add up to so many hours, <laughs> it'd be a little bit better. But, yeah. I'm actually going to have her do a celebration we're gonna pay bills actually gonna have her do a celebration live stream on switch and we're back her final grades are a b a plus a plus so yeah b was the one she barely studied for because time just hit her hit me upside the head let's be honest it hit me upside the head <laughs> but yes perfect first year is done oh my god don't mind him he's i don't even see that <laughs> i've literally been zoned out this whole time would you like to sign up for another term yes oh my god <laughs> 
We'll do another four classes. Complete eight classes to graduate. So that means only she's going to graduate early and do about three years. She did the fast track, girl. Oh, they said she can move off campus now that Oliver is there. She ain't leaving her baby with Oliver. Many months later. Okay, so I haven't played in a while because I'm trying to edit all the Let's Play that I have. So I have more space on my computer. But I did want to just record this little part. She's basically on her last term. Let me just exit out of this. She's basically on her last term. She was. She's going to ace this. She only needs um, four more classes. And she's going to ace this. But I realized that... I could have cheated this whole time and just given her the degree and we could have been doing more things than her just going to college because the college mod stresses me out so bad. Um, so yes, <laughs> um, I just wanted to show you guys um, the cheat, even though she's basically done. I wanted to do this other cheat, which makes her... Um, what which it's like a university cheat but it requires a mod it requires the twist and mexi's all cheats mod and i don't have that but you can finish the term like so she, what she signed up for right now she could finish it like from just doing the cheat she can university graduate with um a perfect gpa she can get all degrees like um so yeah i was gonna do that one but i need that mod and i feel like getting out of the game and downloading the mod so i'm doing it the long way so this cheat is only to give them the degree but it doesn't oh it's only to give them the, the degree but it doesn't like finish college for them so it's trades dot equip underscore trade space trade um underscore university and her major is in art history so I'm gonna do art history degree b a i'm guessing for bachelor's and then i did honors for the girl because she was gonna have honors anyway the fact that she has a A right now, her GPA is an A, and she was going to get an A in the class. So I did, this was the cheat that I did, and I just um, make sure that this T is capitalized. And um, yeah, so I just did this cheat. If you go on, what is the website? It's Carl Sims, Carl's Guide for like sim cheats and stuff i go on it all the time because i'm always looking up a cheat <laughs> um but i just wanted to show you guys that's what the sheet is so you just basically change that and you change out the major that you want to give them so then as you can see she's still technically enrolled so what we'll do is we'll go and we'll go to find a job and why does she still have that case i thought i took that off but okay so when you get here it took a little bit to load, but it has like the little green marks and the green marks is what the person's degree is in. So what jobs like she can, she can still do any job she wants, but it's just lower pay because she didn't go to uh, college for it. So she could do the patrons of the arts. Um, basically your taste in art is impeccable and you can make great things happen and show off what you know as a patron of the arts reward includes the rustic dream bed um you could do zats you could do that one you could do the arts critic which is 256 set the standard for the artistic endeavors um that's cool and then the last one is a trendsetter and the trendsetter is 408 dollars an hour the task of a trendsetter is to create trends through the medium of fashion and clothing by affecting the look of the world true peace may be achieved in our time so of course we're gonna do the 408 dollars uh, an hour um the patron of the arts is only 177 an hour and girl if this was real life i'd be like please and the arts critic is 256 i was thinking about the arts critic but 
and she's not really really into the art so we'll do trendsetter like she's more into the fashion part of the arts and so it says find a job should Taryn switch activities to best self helper she will quit her current position of alternate upon accepting do a new activity to do a new activity okay so oh yep so signing bonus due to her degree in this field Taryn has been awarded a signing bonus of two thousand dollars and fifty cents should Taryn sure she can get a jump start on her stuff um cool 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 so what we're going to do is we're going to withdraw from the term should Taryn withdraw from university she won't be allowed to enroll for another time for another term this will also for for any scholarship she might have Hey guys, it's Kayla slash Lazy Simmer here. So I wanted to end this episode here. I know this is a really short episode. This is the shortest episode I've ever had. Um, I just realized with all the clips, everything is just really like jumping around because all I'm trying to do is get her like situated and I was just like bringing you guys along. So there's not really any story to tell. So... Um, I'm going to have um, two videos come out the same day so after you watch this video episode 13 episode 13 will be right after this um, they will come at, out the same day so that you guys will be able to enjoy um, some some good drama instead of just like a little baby update and I know as of right now it's already summer as this was supposed to be our spring season um so we're not gonna really talk about that we're just going to you know you know just keep pushing uh i lost my creative funk a little bit and then i had went back to my home um my home state and left my external hard drive with everything on it there and yeah but now i'm back and i'm ready to have you guys really hear Taryn's story and see my new LP and all this stuff so definitely give this video a thumbs up and I hope you guys enjoyed this little like update on her life and I hope you guys are excited for episode 13 as well bye